Hey, what's going on with it once again? Bros, women, especially bronies and pegasus, the one, the only, Mr. Nintendo Free 2011, a.k.a. Criticism Guy 2009. First of all, I definitely got to give a big, super huge shout out. I don't know about you guys, she's originally definitely amazing. She has a really cute, sexy British accent. She's awesome as hell. Definitely check her out. Her name is um, Obap Scribbler, a.k.a. Scribbler. She actually gave me a comment last night, which I was completely unaware of, but so I had to check on my main page and I actually got 200 plus subscribers like around 203 right now so that's a pretty good ass accomplishment because I was thinking until maybe December January next year I'd get up to 200 <laughs> I got that way earlier than I expected so shout out to every single one of you guys I will be doing a separate video on that I might do a two part video on here too just in case so uh, basically um, without further ado now, I don't have any um, you know slideshows for this one so uh, yeah let's get this started so basically this is a Another Rainbow Dash Scoot Loot thing, and since I already got past 200 subs, I might as well talk about it. Plus, um, Scribbler, I know she did a really amazing job doing the voice. She didn't do, like, the best of the best job, but she did do a pretty good job. Um, she kind of sounded like Marge Simpson from The Simpsons. I'm not trying to make fun of her or anything, but she definitely, all in all, she still did a really fantastic job. Stay, same with my girl. Definitely awesome chick. Definitely check her out. Her name's on um, Shadow007. I've talked about her numerous numerous amounts of times, so definitely check her stuff out. So yeah, basically, um, Rainbow Dash is checking on Scootaloo, um, wondering why she's not able to fly and everything, and uh, she's really, really sad. And I know there's a lot of memes and jokes out there about Scootaloo not having a family, and how she's a chicken and stuff like that. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it there. And uh, but other than that, what happens is um, Scootaloo, she. You know, she's really depressed, she's feeling real sad, and um, Rainbow Dash really wants to, like, cheer her up. And most of you guys know, you, I really wanted to make an introduction, and I know she's my very least favorite pony, I said Applejack and Twilight, but, I don't know, there's very few times where her loyalty actually kicks in. It's really awesome. I'm sorry for your noise in the background, too, it's super fucking windy out here right now. Excuse my language, but it is. And uh, she's telling her, oh, don't worry, I want to show you something. <laughs> And then after that, um, she was um, talking about the weather Pegasus pony. It's her job to, you know, water her flowers from Ponyville the time to time. And after that, she's telling her all. She's just explaining Sco Scootaloo. She's giving her the rundown on, like, how she, like, does her little weather routine. Because um, they got to make sure that they spet, that they bloom right after um, they get watered and everything like that. She's kind of in charge about all that stuff. I like how they did that little thing, you know, I'll admit that, even though she's my least favorite. I really love how the artist, and I'll put a link to his channel here, I think his name's Thunderhawk. I know you guys can't see it. Oh, and by the way, I got a new monitor, by the way, just in case. Oh, and you saw that other one, too. <laughs> I already got her from, like, a different DeviantArt, I don't know. I really like how they made her, like, sit like that, that was really funny. And she was pretty much explaining to Scootaloo she's a late bloomer when it comes to flying. What happens after that, she wants her to look very, very carefully. I like, um, what happens to this flower, even though they get to bloom with the rest of them, which was right here. And they all look beautiful and fantastic, unique and everything, and all their little, like, different shapes, ways, and forms. I really love how I'm Shadow, she did Scootaloo's voice. It's really cute. It's really amazing. It's really, you know, heartwarming. I was even almost bursting into tears when I saw this. I'm not going to lie. And after that, she's like, <gasps> ooh, ooh. <gasps> You know, she's making all these really funny noises and everything. <laughs> and after that, she says, see, even if the flower is late, once it is bloomed, it became one of the most beautiful of them all. And after that, she says, and that flower is you, Scootaloo. And after that, what she's saying, oh, like, you really think that's me? And then she gives her a little explanation. So, oh, of course, you know, maybe you can't fly like the other guys yet, but when your time comes, and then you will... <clears throat> then you are going to bloom. You will become just as best as the other flies in all the question. Just as awesome as me, you know, that type of shit. Trust me, I know that. You just have to be patient. And after that, she starts crying and everything. And then she ends up calling her sister and everything. Thank you, sister. I like how they did that little animation thing. I know it's kind of like a little bit of an error right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. But it's really still nice nevertheless. Looks like one of Twilight Celestia's and Luna's like royal like sneakers or whatever. So shout out to this guy that made it. Very amazing dude. I'll put the story down here below and then the music if you want to listen to music. Those beautiful freaking heavenly trumpets. Damn freaking phenomenal. I'm telling you right now. You know, 
that's what made the emotion stir for me in my opinion you know just brought the elements straight head on that's what i'm talking about you know just pulls your heartstrings a little bit no no pun intended to lyra heartstrings but that's what it does so i definitely got to give this a five out of five ten out of ten or ten who's out of ten for the comic dub you know they're definitely really awesome youtubers and um storytellers and comic dubs i know um shadow once in a while she do a creepypasta so definitely check her out and that's pretty much it so like i always say peace out bros one burns the practice i will see you when i see you guys have a good day have a good night wherever you're at around the world don't drink and smoke weed at the same time don't do anything reckless um talk to you guys soon have a good day good night late goodbye and uh see you soon and see you around all right oh yeah one last thing i'll be doing at least five or six more videos it's not today probably tomorrow tuesday for sure because i still got to go out to target or walmart to get my um pokemon x and y unboxing thing definitely stay in tune for that i'll try to put the link in the next video if you want to check that out and yeah peace lates goodbye and i'll see you around and definitely shout out once again to um, shadow 007 especially you scribbler you're amazing i love all your amazing little voices you're creative beyond words to describe you know words can't describe how amazing you are all right lates and i'm gone